Hello and welcome. My name is Alan Burgess and today we're going to be tying this yellow streamer fly or as we call it here in Canterbury a lure. The lure we're going to tie is the yellow lady. This is used to target salmon and large sea run trout therefore we need a good strong hook. I like to use a size 2 Camazan B175. These are chemically sharpened high carbon traditional trout lure hooks. The most popular hook sizes are 1 down to 4. Place the hook in the vise and underbind and then add a small red tag just above the barb. This can be red hackle, red marabou or even teased red knitting wool. Then add a length of uh, oval tinsel and bind that on. At this stage I like to apply a liberal coating of cement to keep everything bound nice and tight. Next we tie in the yellow body material. Uh, for this we're going to be using uh, chenille that's got a little crystal flash run through it for a bit of extra sparkle. You can use just plain yellow chenille or even plain yellow wool or as has become quite popular in recent times a kind of loud fluoro lime green coloured chenille. Carry the chenille body on down to the head and then stop just a couple of millimetres short and trim. This is a Matuka style pattern even though we're using a strip of rabbit skin with the fur attached instead of a pair of feathers. The strip of pelt about three millimetres wide is tapered at each end. We then lay this on the top of the hook with the hair sloping backwards of course skin side down and secure it firmly with thread. Stroke the fur back towards the eye so that it stands upright. Then wind the tinsel in a tight spiral towards the head. You'll get much better at this with practice. Remember to keep the tinsel tight as you go. I like to use a bodkin to open up the fur but this isn't essential. This is quite a gaudy fly, I'm sure you'll agree. But yellow stands out well in our big east coast rivers, which are often discoloured following rain or snow melt. Continue the process here, taking the tinsel down to the head. Now at this point we can call the fly pretty much finished. However I like to add either a little very light blue or pearl flasher blue to the sides. You can also add a topping of peacock hurl or as many do a hackle collar. Some tyres even add uh, a contrasting colour for their hackle collar such as shocking pink or orange. The length of the wing should be no more than twice the length of the body or perhaps a bit shorter than that otherwise you risk getting the dreaded short take where a fish grabs the tail of the lure and shakes but doesn't get hooked. At this point all that's required is a few hitches around the finger, one, two, three, around there and pull that tight and then a, a second one for good luck and uh, pull that tight and trim. 
I like to add plenty of head cement. You should always check the eyes of the hooks later just in case you've accidentally filled it completely and have to poke it out with bodkin. And there we have it, all ready to catch a salmon or a sea run trout in the Rakaia or the Rangitata or the Huranui River. The Yellow Lady.